Yo, what's going on, guys? It's your boy Brandon bringing you yet another reaction video. Count them three at least recorded today in regards to posting them. I hope I can post them all on the same day. If not, uh, check out um, my reaction videos to Invent Animate's newest song. I did one for Bella Haven's newest song. And now we're doing one for at least my girl Taylin. I love her. Just met her a couple, roughly about a month ago. Great human being. Um, and uh, wanted to to do a reaction video to their newest song alexandrite and pearl i'm pretty sure i pronunciated it right if not sorry if i butchered it but um yeah i absolutely love what taylin has been doing with least uh and i wanted to signal boost it a little bit more so i have not listened to the song at all this is going in hot and fresh out the kitchen so um definitely excited to check out this new lease song uh check the links below to go check out lease please go give them the support the love the admiration whatever down in the description um they deserve it and uh love those love love those fools they're the best so um let's go give their new song alexandre and pearl a listen oh love the riffs Uh, this guitar riff is so sick. Love it. It's that, it's that chord change that gets me. I love it. Also, the bass is grooving. Oh, nice stop. I like that. That was cool. Ooh, I really like this, like, real, like, riffy, riffy bridge part. This is great. Nice rhythm change, all right. The layering, oh my god. Oh man, that was fantastic. Oh my god. Kudos. Kudos to Lise. Guys, if you're just checking in, this is Lise's newest song, Alexandre and Pearl. Um, man, what a, what a track. I think this might be, honestly, the best Lise song I've heard to date. Um, just really riffy, real, like, again, I, to me, they, they kind of emulate a great, like, post-hardcore kind of emo sound. Um, 
which I you you know that's my bread and butter I love that stuff but I really think that this song is an absolutely standout track um definitely reminds me a lot of like uh, a hail the sun kind of vibe um in terms of the kind of like the guitar work it feels very like you know very hail the sun um a little bit like old school emo you know which we love uh and just man it, it's just so catchy um some of the chord changes were just really like thought provoking really thoughtful and um and i just think it's awesome i think Taylor does a great job fronting the band uh and i also believe she plays guitar if i'm not mistaken i could 100 percent be wrong on that one um but i know she does play guitar from from what i remember could be 100 percent wrong on this i <laughs> i'm just spitballing now um but i do feel like this song specifically as much as i liked a power blazer i feel like they have just stepped it up so much in terms of the just like sonic presence going on in this track the layering on this song was great i think you can really hear a lot of that fantastic layering in that like bridge more so the sort of end of the song um you could really hear a lot of those great layers vocally i think some of the like just the instrumentation the way that that's written it all worked really well in harmony together and again wanted to give it a shout out because i think it's awesome i will also say as well um i really love Taylor's vocals i think she does a fantastic job of like again hitting that sweet spot in my heart for just like emo sounding vocals i think she has this way of like kind of conveying um lyricism and like tonality to you um in a way that i feel like um other people might have a little bit harder of a time it just feels very feels very fluid right it feels very like it feels very approachable you know and then also at the same time just the actual like vocal prowess of her fantastic i think again this is i'm you know gonna be hella biased but i do feel like this is the best lee song to be released thus far i have listened to all of their music um but this one takes the cake for me uh instrumentation wise i think her whole band collectively is massively talented um the guitar work was fantastic definitely love the guitar riffs um i know i say this a lot and i feel like i'm beating a dead horse but um i absolutely like love a great guitar riff i am a perf you know personally i am a guitar player myself and i know i mentioned this in the previous video i released reaction wise uh i also said how much i love the guitar work in that song um but i will say very similarly to that song i absolutely love the guitar work in this song as well um it is the thing that i gravitate towards the most uh, I can't help it but the guitar work was really really sick but I'll also give an award to the bass playing on this track this their bass player is nuts like some of the riffs just like it didn't have to be there but I think it made the song more special because it just had its way of like kind of flowing in and out of the song where you're like man it would be really cool if there was like a really sick bass riff here boom they hit you with a sick bass riff uh, and I think that that's really nice that there's just like that nice play between the guitars and the in the bass playing thought that was really tight and i'll also say as well too the drumming also great too um i definitely feel like the drumming and the bass playing play off of each other but i like that the bass playing kind of goes off and does their own thing as well um it's just very fluid very like methodical but it doesn't it doesn't feel fluid in the sense that it feels unorganized i think everything has a sort of like cap on where it goes but there is that nice like flow in between um all the instrumentations that make it really interesting interesting um but yeah absolutely love this song i don't feel like i have to show for it enough here but you know your boy gonna keep doing that because that's what i'm good at but uh but yeah i absolutely love this song it was awesome i'm very excited to see what they have next i know that this song as well as uh power blazer are going to be released on a seven inch vinyl if you're a vinyl head much like myself um go pick it up i'll leave links below for that as well um and then go pick up their previous album it was also fantastic as well i can't remember the name because i'm really blanking and i'm and i'm getting old so yeah uh i'll flash the the well the the album is on the screen currently it's in either the top right hand corner or the middle left those are the the same album art i i just don't remember the name of it i'm just gonna put it up here on the screen um but yeah absolutely love that record as well um and lease has just been killing it so if you haven't heard of least check the links below uh i've had Taylor on twice now uh and she's a fantastic guest so go check out those 
interviews uh, if you haven't already. Um, and then let me know down in the comments below what your thoughts are on this new Leash track. Do you like it? Do you hate it? Where you guys sit at? Would love to know. Um, honestly, I think it's a bop, so you should go give it a listen uh, if you didn't listen to it while watching this video. So uh, please go do that. Go give him a subscribe. Tell him I sent you. Uh, go give him a follow on social media. Same thing uh, as well. And uh, if you enjoyed this video, share it, like, and subscribe. It goes a long way. I have been just putting out a ton of videos as of recently. So if you are new, there's plenty of content to go around here on the channel. So thank you guys for watching. Hope to see you in the next video. Peace.